it is now Kawamoto's turn to serve. Good reaction by Ben on that netball, another netball. Let's back this one on up. Okay, Kawamoto's turn to serve. Serving to Ben. They're obviously stacking. Ben goes to uh, Rindmeyer. I think he's going to do that a lot to try and hold him back. And now they're playing the point. Ben realizes, hey, okay, you've hit a good drop. That's a quality drop to my backhand. I'm conceding that you've made it to the kitchen line and hits a dink. Rindmeyer makes an aggressive decision to try and hit winner or keep Ben on the defensive. Goes off the tape, and Ben gets it back. Let's see here. A little more tape. Yeah, and basically, Ridmeyer's backhand again, not having the type of touch that you want. So why is that happening? Now, this isn't the best frame for it, but I really want you guys to see this. Watch how far back... His paddle is here, and it's going to keep moving back this way. It literally moves so far back it goes out of frame, and that's what you really have. Now, did the ball go off the net, and it's hard to adjust? Absolutely. But he comes way far back with the ball, and there's the swing. Okay. See how he swings at it instead of using his leg to push off and move his body forward? He just gets – and the way you can tell this – especially when you have slower film, and we can even tell it on this one. It's the knee angle, and I'm going to leave that red right there. And now watch these next several frames. Watch if that knee shifts. If the knee releases, it's like doing a squat. You're releasing the power you have in your leg into the ball, and what is moving the ball forward is your leg muscles. You're hitting it with your leg and not your arm. And what he does is he doesn't move his leg hardly at all and just swings with the arm what that does is that one makes you way less consistent but two because you're swinging you're normally now you're not dinking you're going to hit the ball too far which he does ben is low and ready impacts his ball from below it and just he's not even really hitting what he's just putting it back into his body and look at that swing again at it just swings Puts all that power into the ball, and the ball is just flying out. Instead of having control, getting the ball out in front of your body. Also, oh, man, this. There's so much in this match, uh, and we normally don't get this amount per point. So I apologize that these are going very long, but I really, this is just quality footage for everybody to learn from. And here's the big thing that I want to also point out. Look at this ready position. There was just a a TikTok video about changing your paddle to be more on the um, backhand side, and then that would be better, and the film doesn't agree with that. So the number one thing is if you're on this backhand side, you are in a defensive position all the time. You're going to be able to put away less, much less balls. But the bigger thing on this one is, is Rindmeyer doesn't get – to a proper ready position with the paddle out in front of him because look how the paddle is completely in his body. He had time, not as much time as he would like from this, so he swings. Look how far out the paddle is in front of his body. Paddle is completely out in front of his body, and he takes his paddle and puts it all the way back into his body, and that's his. this is his ready position now for this shot. And then there's nowhere to go. You're a spring that's completely coiled, you can't absorb anything and clearly can't, and so then that ball sails long. He needs to, if you if you have your hand out nice in front, keep it out in front and be ready for the next one. Look at, I guess the greatest comparison is, let's look at Annalie Waters right here across. Her paddle is nice, even, straight in front. She can go backhand, forehand, and it's in front of her perfectly straight she's not favoring the backhand side she's not favoring the forehand side she's got that paddle at 12 o'clock um 
I will find a, uh, when we get a camera angle to explain what I mean by 12 o'clock. For those who are, this is their first time, I will do that. But man, a lot of information to take away from that point.